enjoy watching other actors acting? Well, I love watching other actors acting. I, I've been obsessed by acting since I was a child and uh, I'm a great connoisseur of it and I think I'm quite a good judge of it. And uh, so I, I adore watching other actors work when it's good. When it's not, uh, it's a great pain to me. Who were the first great actors you saw? As a young man and a boy, I was extraordinarily lucky to see that fabled generation of actors, of, of, of Gielgud Richardson, Olivier, Edith Evans, Peggy Ashcroft, people now almost all completely forgotten. Uh, 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 even if they made movies, it's unlikely that people of a younger generation know who they are, but, but uh, when they were alive and kicking and uh, doing their extraordinary work on stage, uh, it, it, it was something quite, quite remarkable. I mean, it was, it was the sort of thing that nobody attempts anymore. Do any modern actors come close to that golden generation? In uh, movies, not always, but, but, but sometimes Daniel Day-Lewis does, uh, I think, probably approach a role in the way that a Lawton might have approached it. Is there anything you don't like about acting? I don't much like wearing makeup. I sweat a lot, it comes off, it's uncomfortable, it's sticky, you can't... And I, I do everything I can to avoid wearing makeup. Do you still get stage fright? I don't get stage fright, but I do get self-conscious, and I hate that, and I wish I didn't, particularly at events like First Nights, because I, I don't know how it's impossible to ignore the fact that there are at least 100 people sitting out there judging you. You know, I think almost all actors feel a tremendous longing for the first night to be over, but it has to happen. It's like a sort of operation. It's, it, you, you know it's got to happen, it's going to hurt, but you will feel better afterwards. <laughs>